guys and welcome back to the channel. If you guys are new to the channel, welcome. My name is Ken, also known as The Pop Air. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to do this makeup look. So probably a few days ago, or maybe a week now, um, by the time you guys see this video, I posted this photo on Instagram. As you guys can see, it's really nice and bold. Um, I basically created this eyeshadow look using a drugstore palette. It's the Sleek Storm palette. And yeah, if you guys are interested in knowing how I created this look using the palette, definitely keep on watching. Okay, so let's get started. I'm going to start off first with some primer. This one is my favorite. This one is by Krylin. And as you guys can see, I'm not actually wearing my colored contacts today. I thought I would go all natural. Is that how you say it? So the other day I was just like on Instagram as you do and I saw a lot of people playing around with rose gold metallic eyeshadows and I thought I really want to buy an eyeshadow like that because I think it's just such a unique colour and you know I thought I would just go look around in my collection to see if I can find something that is quite similar and that way I don't have to buy it because let's be real I have so many palettes I shouldn't really buy anymore. So this palette didn't actually make it into my eyeshadow collections video. Um, I completely forgot I still had sleek makeup in my collection. I don't know it was just like in the really back corner of my makeup drawer so this one is the sleek storm palette this is my favorite one and in that instagram photo that i showed you guys i actually use a combination of these colors and to make them very very metallic i'm going to show you guys a little trick so i'm just going to grab that color over there this one is more like a flesh tone color on my skin and i'm just going to use that to set the base and i'm using a bold metals collection eyeshadow brush this one is the oval one or it's just called the number 200 brush Alright, next I'm going to grab the Deluxe Crease Brush and I'm going to take that dark brown colour and I'm just going to pop that into the crease as a transition colour. Next I'm going to grab a flat synthetic eyeshadow brush and I'm going to grab that dark plummy colour first. And I'm just going to put this all over the lids. Next I'm going to grab a combination of these two colours here, so this pink and this champagne colour. And I'm going to wet my brush, I'm going to be using the NYX Matte Finish Setting Spray and just oh, spritz that. And what that's basically going to do is turn it into a nice liquid gold metallic eyeshadow look. It's just amazing. Can you guys see that? Look how bright that is, that is incredible. And bam girl, can you see that? It's just super super bright i can't believe it and it's a drugstore palette too so you know that's just incredible next i'm going to take this tiny um blending brush it's just stained it's not actually dirty i'm going to grab a combination of that dark brown and that black and dab off the excess and i'm just going to etch out the crease a bit okay for the eyeliner i'm going to do a subtle flick i'm not going to go for super dramatic i'm going to be using this one from rimmel london this is the color precise eyeliner this one has nice matte finish as well okay the eyeliner is on so i'm just going to do the rest of my makeup i'm going to speed it up with some music if you guys are interested in knowing what other products i use in this video check the description box down below i'll link it all down there as well as the links to websites that you can buy them from if you guys have trouble finding them of my face makeup and going back into the eyes I'm going to grab this pencil type bullet brush from Real Techniques oh caught it um, I'm going to grab that flesh tone color again and mix it with a little bit of that dark brown I'm going to run it on the lower lash line okay for mascara I'm going to be using this one by covergirl this is the plumbify mascara you know what I think these eBay lashes aren't consistent like this one looks really really cross um, fluffy and this one's just Next I'm going to grab a tiny tiny um, pencil brush and I'm going to grab uh, Let's just go with that pale gold again and just pop it onto the inner corners. I swear guys the pigmentation and just the Sheer brightness of this palette is unmatched for the drugstore like seriously. Okay, let's pull my hair down My hair's probably going to be really messed up um, 
yep it is <laughs> i'm going to be grabbing this um nude lip liner from modile and i'm going to use mac velvet teddy but yeah i still use mac velvet teddy pretty much for almost every event like if i go to an event like and i know it's going to be quite a long day i'm going to be wearing it for quite some time i always go with mac velvet teddy or something nude um but nine times out of ten it's always mac velvet teddy it's just such a nice color it complements my skin tone really well whether it be winter or summer it just works really well it's just nice and it doesn't wash me out i find that sometimes when you go too light you can look a little bit washed out and sometimes it just brings emphasis to other imperfections on your face so like for me it's like my um, five o'clock shadow i find that if i go too nude it's just so obvious but of course if you guys would like to go for a bolder color don't you know don't let this video stop you like seriously go for it if you feel like that's going to make your day night whatever do it all right so there you guys go that's the look i'm just going to take some beauty shots now um not that it's anything different from my instagram photo but thank you guys for, okay so there you guys go thank you guys for watching don't forget to thumbs up the video if you guys enjoyed tell me down in the comment box down below are you guys going to do anything special with your significant other on valentine's day or are you just going to hang out with your friends or just treat us like a normal day i don't know let me know what you guys are going to be doing and yeah thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys in the next video Bye.